amo weli hewile just no bwe wa kanya michael from namisidwa district hello jen <laughs> I'm called Justin Obui from Kapua Church of Christ. Yeah, that's my name. Uh, which district? It is uh, from Palisa. Right. Mm. How old are you? I'm 31 years old now. So, what role do you play in your church? In our church, I'm a UC leader. As well, uh, a pastor pastor for a young pastor for the youth. When did you start ministry? I started in 2007 there. Why are you doing this? You're young, you're energetic, you can be out there in the field. Why do you decide to come? I decided to come here to get the knowledge about God. So this study, it is my heart that I should know more about God. That's why I'm here. What, how did you get to know about MTI? MTI, me knowing about MTI, I, I knew it from my pastor, the one who used to come here to study. So, again, another thing, I knew it by, I, I, knew, I knew it by, coming this way in the mission and getting adverts about it. So that's how I knew about MTI. So are you coming for youth conferences or what are you coming for? Yeah, I used to come for youth conferences to the mission. So what has been your experience so far? What have you learned from MTI? So far from MTI, what I've learned is it has equipped me. I've learned more details in the Bible because now in the Old Testament, New Testament survey, I can discover the good essentials or good items in New Testament as to why it was written, the purpose, the authors. So I've discovered many things. Testament essentials, what other courses do you enjoy? There is a, a life of Jesus Christ, life of Christ. So I really enjoyed it because I learned how the life of Christ was very well and I can teach others now. What tools have you picked? What specific tools? Bible, what skills have you learned from MTI training? Yeah, now the skills that I've learned from MTI is uh, more so the, the Bible study. I've learned mostly things in the Bible. I can now teach. So are you excited about uh, graduation? graduation? Very much, I'm excited because this is the thing that I was not to get before. So I'm very excited, I'm very happy for this. Are you graduating advanced or basic? So far right now, I'm graduating for basic. What plans do you have? The, after graduation, the plans that I have are uh, to go out and evangelize teach others also what I what I've got from from here in MTI what I've been learning from here in the MTI so those are the things that I'm going to practice back there in our churches in my village so so how did you get to know about GNPI with the GNPI as I came to MTI, uh, I saw GNPI that it is connected to MTI. 
So that is the way I got to know GNPI because there are some, some machines, projectors that other students used to show from there. Then I asked that, where do you get them? And they explained still the stuff of GNPI used to come and used to come to the institution and educated us about GNPI. Then after me getting access to GNPI, I got essential things that could encourage me in the study, which are connected to what we are studying. So that's how I knew about GNPI. Yes, I used a solar kit. It was very helpful to my life, even to the to the people that I used to show. And still, I do appreciate it. I need to use it still continuously. And even the community that I used to show them need them so so much, and they don't want to miss. They still ask that where can we get it from and request again, bring it. They are appreciating it so so much. So would it help to you as a pastor? Do you hope to use it in the future to graduate? Actually for me as a pastor, the solar kit is so so helpful for me because in the, uh, my evangelism as I take it to the village, to my place, uh, it was very easy for me to teach them by showing them the films of Jesus, films of Ariada. Most of the films saw the solar kit helped me as a pastor. Very easy to evangelize the word. So do you have any comments for GNPI? Yeah, the comments about GNPIR, more videos to be added on the solar kit or the projector, more videos are needed because the time when we take, the time that we take, you find that all of them have got over. So we need other videos which are educative as Christians. Anything you can tell other young pastors? So, for the young pastors, the youth leaders, the, the ones leading the youth, really, I do encourage you to come and study. Come and study about the Word of God. Come to MTI. And there are many things that you will discover when you come and study. You will know many, because even me, before I came, I didn't know. But now I've known, I can now do however much challenges coming, but I can now do and exploit myself for the word of God.